Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In January 2024, the British Army announced the commencement of reducing production for its current assault rifle, the SA-80, also known as the L-85A3, in preparation for the introduction of its successor under Project Greyburn. This transition signifies an evolution in British military equipment, with the SA-80 having served since 1985. Manufactured by the German firearms supplier Heckler & Koch, the SA-80 is a 5.56mm, gas-operated rifle that has undergone three iterations of development. The A1 model was succeeded by the A2 in 2002, and the latest A3 configuration was introduced in 2018. The A2 variant featured a heavier and longer barrel to achieve greater muzzle velocity compared to the original A1 model. Subsequently, the A3 version reduced its visual and infrared signatures, increased scratch resistance, and introduced a new handguard that supports the upper receiver while enhancing precision and accuracy. Despite its deployment by UK forces in recent conflicts like those in Iraq and Afghanistan, as well as earlier engagements such as the First Gulf War and the unrest in Bosnia during United Nations peacekeeping operations, the SA-80 encountered significant jamming and operational failures in adverse environmental conditions before the introduction of the more recent variants. Further details regarding the British Army's efforts to replace and introduce new light weapons were disclosed at the International Dismounted Soldier 2023 conference in London. Project Hunter, now concluded, assessed five rifles and selected Knight's Armaments KS-1, adopted as the L-403A1 in September 2023. This initiative aimed to provide an alternative individual weapon for the British Army's Ranger Regiment and the Royal Marines. The insights gained from the rifle evaluation conducted under Project Hunter will inform the development of Project Greyburn, highlighting the importance of ongoing learning and innovation in equipping British soldiers. Project Greyburn seeks to define the key characteristics of the next-generation individual weapon to replace the SA-80 rifle family, drawing upon the lessons learned from Project Hunter. The new individual weapon system will feature a rifle with a common lower receiver group and variable upper receiver group depending on the role. Variable target acquisition and surveillance systems will also be acquired and distributed based on the role. All rifle variants will utilize a common ammunition, designed around the 5.56x45mm cartridge. While the new rifle is likely to adopt a conventional configuration rather than a bullpup design, similar to the SA-80, detailed information on assault rifles for this project has not yet been disclosed. That's all for now. See you later.